Hi everyone, my name is Lauren and welcome to another episode of Hogwarts Legacy! I went to my friend's wedding last night, so I've kind of lost my voice from singing along to Queen and Abba. <laughs> I also went to bed quite late and I woke up at 12. So here I am recording at 2pm and it's gonna be three hours and then that's my day gone, so... <laughs> anyway, I can't stop thinking about this game and I just need to play more, so let's dive right in. Okay, so we should be on our way to Honeydukes, I think. Hopefully there's not gonna be um, <laughs> too much creepy stuff around here. Hello? Oh, we're gonna be finding something. Anything behind here? Yes, there's a chest. Love that for me! 56 galleons! This castle will never cease to surprise me. No, it's great. Oh, wait. Are these mushrooms? Oh, yeah. Pork lumpies. Imagine, like, sneaking out of the castle this way. I just wonder how the marauders had Rebellion. the time to, like, find all this. And make their map. Oh, hell no. Right, we're gonna be fighting some spiders, so I'm just gonna get, um, <laughs> Confringo out. Confringo! Yeah. Rebellion. Mm, I don't like this, there's too many spider webs. something really creepy I can feel it also the way the spell system at the bottom right is set up really reminds me of Dragon Age Inquisition which is one of my favorite games um, so that makes me very happy oh maybe it's just I'm trapped how am I supposed to get out of here um, Let me fear not to my child Akio. Work? Oh no, you just jump up there. Here we go. I'm going to have to get past this. Oh, I like that there's little obstacles so we can use Levioso there. I'm just gonna go over here. Hello? Ew, is there something in the water? Rebellion. What's in the water? <laughs> Repair it. There we go. And then we make it fly. Can we make this jump. Oh god. Rebellion. Anything else? That seems to be it. Oh dude, these spider webs can bring us. There we go. Pavilion. Hey, bats. How are you doing? Living your best life, I see. One more to go and I'll make it across. Mm. Reparo. And let me also. Something is getting in the way of that platform. Um, can we accurate? Oh god, nearly falling off this platform. Oh no! Oh, I fucked it. Oh, I fucked it. I fucked it. Levioso. Oh, well, that worked. That did the trick. <laughs> Thank god, oh my goodness. Okay, we're gonna be sliding down this hill, I feel like. Rebellion. 
Sorry, I'm just trying to see if there's monsters up ahead. Or can I go in the water? Is that what it's telling me to do? Will something attack Rebellion. me? No? Okay, we're gonna go across. <laughs> I'm always wary of going into the water. Smart for Dora. Lovely. I'm worried some monster will come out and get me. Oh. Nope. Oh, can we- Oh my god! Get up the platform! <laughs> um... Oh, it says there's a chest behind there. Repair. Oh no, I need to- Confirm do us. And do that. And then stand on here? Something smells sweet. Must be close to honey juice. Oh. Maybe I should, um... Nice. Um, there's these bags. I don't know if I'm stealing at the moment. I really hope I'm not. I am taking stuff that is someone else's. <gasps> We're in Honey Dukes. Should I use an invisibility potion? I don't know. I don't even know if I have one. Hogsmeade, here I come. Avelio. Oh, we're in the secret. Honey Dukes. I can smell the chocolate. Now, where would I find the dried billywig stings for Gareth? Surely they must know this passage connects to... Well, actually, maybe these people were actual students. In... Uh-oh, I can hear them. I have the dried billywig stings. Now, back to Gareth. I can only imagine how his new recipe is going to turn out. We have to go out the front? Will they know? Uh-oh. I'm kind of worried they're gonna know that we didn't come in the front. Um, let's just go. I can't believe we just did that. God, it's so nice. All I want to do is just actually hang out here. Oh, what's this? Don't forget to get it was an accident. Basilisk breeder insists. The Cornish wizard arrested for breeding basilisks interesting choice of breeding um, has insisted it was all simply a silly mistake. He was taken in after routine inspection revealed toad infestations um, in all five of his chicken coops. Basil's breeding has long been forbidden by the ministry. However, due to the potency, rarity and value of basilisk venom, it is perhaps not surprising to know that the less rule abiding amongst us have skirted the law. As explained by a neighbor of the wizard in custody, a shrouded figure who has chosen to remain anonymous, the way to make a basilisk is by hatching a chicken egg behind a, beneath a toad. Every wizard with the ones knows that. But that's, um, I didn't, like, uh, Gareth, I don't know if I should be worried about giving you this. Hello, Gareth. I have those dried billywig stings. You got them. Incredible. Here they are. Happy to help. Here you go. This is brilliant. Can't wait to get started. Thank you again. I'll let you know when I brewed my first batch of fizzing whiz beer. You're welcome. And now we found one of the secret passages, which is very, very cool. Right, you guys. I think it's time we go to another quest. We could tell Professor Fig about the map chamber, which is a main quest. We've also got a few assignments from other... Um, I might do this first. Right, Professor Fig, I am coming for you. Hello. I was hoping to see you. I have some news. You're back. Finally. Minister Spavin talks more than he listens. Ranted on and on about rogue dragons. Wouldn't listen to a word about goblins. Speaking of which... Listen, Professor. So much happened while you were away. 
Your friend, Mr. Ollivander, sent me an owl asking for help finding an heirloom wand that was stolen from him. He did, did he? And so I went to the owlery, like he said, and there were all these statues. What do you mean, statues? In the owlery? Yes, which led me to a secret hideout where I found Richard Jackdaw's ghost. Who on earth is <laughs> Richard Jackdaw? So much just happened, sir. He was a sir. student here long ago. Keep up. Anyway, he told me about a secret cavern. I went there, and right next to Jackdaw's skeleton, I found the missing pages. You found the pages? I did. And because Jackdaw had followed the map they contained, when I found the pages, I found the location on the map. Believe it or not, it's a room below Hogwarts. Why am I not surprised? Shall we? I was hoping you'd say that. Oh, and we'll need to bring the book. All right. Let's go. Very the exciting. Room is I get the to map show you chamber, this. By the way, and a portrait of Percival Rackham awaits us there. Professor Rackham. I look forward to meeting him. How did this Jackdaw get the pages from the book? Evidently, Peeves stole them, and Jackdaw stole them from him. Oh, Peeves. Right, sir, are you ready? To think it was beneath us all this time. Wow, it's so beautiful. Where we have to place the bird. This looks promising. I feel like I should be the one stepping in there, not you, just in case. Wow, it looks like a starry night. Look at it move as you walk through. Made. And over here, the Forbidden Forest. And of course, Hogwarts. It's magnificent. If only you were here to see this. Oh my god, this is stunning, guys! Look at this! I'm so sorry, I just want to take this in. Oh, it looks like it's beneath ice. Oh. There's something over here with like. some kind of power. Hello, Professor Rackham. We've placed the book on the pedestal, as you asked. And this is my mentor, Professor Fig. How do you do, Professor Fig? And you, my young friend, see now why you needed to return with the book? Yes. I, do. I also see why you refer to this room as the map chamber. That you have come this far tells me that you possess extraordinary magical ability. The potential and what power of which will unlock should you prove yourself worthy. The location of each of four trials will, in time, appear on the map. Trials that will test you and give you access to invaluable knowledge. Trials that you must complete on your own. Do you recall the pensive memory you viewed in my vault in Gringotts? Um, yes, I do actually. You and your friend Charles spoke of the port key and of trials you'd created for one who sees traces of ancient magic. Precisely. Charles is another of the Keepers, a designation we gave ourselves centuries ago, in light of the knowledge that we have been bound to keep hidden. Until, perhaps, now. 
So, the passage from your ruins to Gringotts, everything in the vault, the restricted section, finding this room, none of these was a trial. They were an important part of the journey, but they were not trials themselves. The fact that you have come this far, however, bodes well. The trials were designed to ensure that the power and knowledge we have kept secret for so long does not fall into the wrong hands. They will test your abilities, both innate and learned. But of equal importance, everything you witness as you complete the trials will inform what you choose to do with all that we share. You will need patience. The trials have much to teach you. It will take time. Is this... I'm afraid we don't have the luxury of time. We have waited this long, Professor Fig. Surely a few more. Respectfully, sir, while I do not know the secret you keep, I do know that our young friend here has seen traces. Traces of a powerful dark magic being wielded by goblin kind. And we encountered an uncommonly powerful goblin wielding such magic as we prepared to leave your vault at Gringotts. We may already be too late. This is grave news indeed. Young friend, do you trust Professor Fig? I do. Then, in the light of your considerable skill and all you have already accomplished, we shall begin. You will find the location of the first trial marked on the map below you. Thank you. Whilst Professor Fig may assist you in locating the trials, they may be completed only by one with our ability. I don't know whether to trust Shall we Fig. Have a look? There's something about him where I just feel like he's gonna turn bad. I know that tower. It's that, not far. Is that the you may have seen it yourself. I think I have. It looks familiar. <laughs> Perhaps your young friend is more well traveled than you might think. As your mentor, the least I can do is go ahead to make sure it is safe. Join me as soon as you can. Do you know anything about the tower? You said that you know that tower. What can you tell me about it? Not much, I'm afraid. I've passed it dozens of times. It's north of Hogsmeade. My recollection is that it seems abandoned. Clearly, however, the tower conceals more than meets the eye. Okay, I'll see you there. I'll find you at the tower as soon as I can. Until then, be careful. And do not tell anyone where you're going. So I'm wondering if this is where we have to decide whether to go down a good path or an evil path. Oh, I got talent point. Hell yeah. Level 18, baby. Okay, well, thank you, sir. See ya. Oh, wait, let me just it's check It's time you learned Iglesias, the freezing spell. It is an efficient way to cool down a heated situation. But first, I will need you to complete a few tasks. Once you've done that, come and see me. Um, okay, before we do a main quest, I kind of want to make sure we keep up with our assignments. So maybe Madam Kogawa, I really hope I pronounced that right, um, has conjured a number of balloons around Hogsmeade Station and the Quidditch pitch. She wants me to make my use my broom. Okay, let's do that first. I just want to make sure we keep up with our schoolwork because, you know, I am a Ravenclaw. <laughs> um, and it's important to me. So I just want to make sure we keep up with our assignments. Let's start with the flying one because that seems like a fairly easy one. And then the other ones, I think we have to collect potions for and such. Um, potentially brew them, so I don't, I don't know. I just want to make sure that we have everything we need. Um, where do we start? I think we start with these ones. Oh, look at these cherry blossoms. I don't know if I've seen this before. Anyway. Oh, there's people walking on this <laughs> this road. Ah, I don't know why I'm having such a hard time controlling my broom. Oh my goodness. Ah, 
Wait, what's down here? What is this? Revenia. Oh. There's a lock here, a level 11 lock. Okay, we'll just have to come back. I don't see the last, oh there. You are well hidden, my dude. Nice, okay, and then next one. <gasps> the boathouse! Oh my God, wait, I haven't actually checked out the boathouse yet. I don't know. I just I can't explain how cool it is to see all of this. Revelio. Revelio. Flu flames discovered. Um, and then last but not least. Confringo. Thank you. I'll take this, please. Revelio. Okay. Let's go pop some balloons. The next ones we have to pop are above the Quidditch pitch. So let's do that. I feel like I need to get better at flying. I'm like really bad at this. I wonder if this is actual practice for when the Quidditch DLC comes out. Oh, see? <laughs> ah! Okay. Where's the last Revenia. one? Balloon, balloon, balloon. Balloon? There. Brilliant! Nice! Assignment complete! Let's go see Madame Kogawa. Let's go in here. Is this our little flat? Oh, oh I've never been in here. Tasks. I'm so sorry to be barging in this late. Oh man, we need a Lohomora. What is this? Dear Madame Kogawa, I'm writing to do with Professor Black's decision to cancel Quidditch. As you know, joining a professional Quidditch team is my utmost dreams and I believe my chances will now be ruined, or at least significantly thwarted. Professor Weasley insists that we must defer to the headmaster and she encouraged me to practice on my own. I have devised some challenging trials for myself, but it's not at, the, at all the same as practicing on the pitch. Nothing is. Please, could I ask you that you speak to the headmaster or to Professor Weasley? I shall be miserable my whole life if I can't play Quidditch properly for this entire year. Thank you, Professor. <sighs> Imelda. I'm sorry for making a mess. Madam Kogawa, I completed the list of tasks you assigned. Wonderful. I love how she's always like... I trust you became more familiar with your broom through the process? Um, I did. Yes, Professor. That's good to hear. Keep it up, and perhaps one day you'll have a spot on the Quidditch team. Oh, if thank you Black very much. If permits Quidditch again. Well, with those tasks out of the way, let us get started. Glacius. Glacius. Pay attention I love learning to new spells. your wand work. Well we, done. We learned it. I'd recommend that you practice your new spell here in my office before taking it out into the world. Okay. What can I use it on? Um, and where is it? Up here. Um. Thank you. 
Oh, I um, probably should have <laughs> used it on this, not your there furniture. You Catching them quickly. Nice. All right. Well, thank you very much for teaching me. See you later. <laughs> I'm sorry for freezing everything. Great. Right. Next assignment. Mandrake. So what we need is a mandrake. Do we get one at Herbology is my question. So what we need is mandrakes. I'm assuming we can grow them in here or get them in here. Hi Professor Garlic, where can I get mandrakes from? Professor. Professor, what made you want to teach Herbology? How lovely of you to ask. I've always had an affinity for greenery, so this situation is a bit of a dream come true. After graduation, I was thrilled to be asked to step in for my old herbology professor. He'd had a slight accident, you see. Oh dear. A shame for him, but it worked out well for you. That's mm. true. Well, he never cared. I mean, really cared for the plants, and they could sense it. Oh, you'd be surprised how perceptive a plant can be. At any rate, the trouble began one day when he cut into a Wigan tree. Unfortunately for him, its leaves were hiding a bow truckle. You may recall the marvellous creatures that resemble a twig. The little beast gouged the professor's eyes quite fiercely, but terrifying, I'd imagine. Uh, likely for the professor, too. And that's when you took over as the herbology professor? Well, not quite. After three weeks at St. Mungo's, my predecessor regained a tiny bit of his eyesight. He insisted on returning to the greenhouse. Within a week, he had, he claims by accident, kicked a Chinese chomping cabbage. So it was back to St. Mungo's for him. That's almost comical. <laughs> Fair bit of bad luck there, I'd say. Hmm. Well, I felt awful for him, but I dare say I felt a bit more sympathy <laughs> for the Priorities. Cabbage. Upon his discharge from the hospital, his indifference to plants had turned to utter disdain. He lost what little patience he had left with a particularly temperamental venomous tentacula and well his wow, this resulting is quite the story. leave of absence continues to this day. I'm glad things I'm out I'm glad everything worked yeah. out as it did and that you're the herbology I can't professor talk today. now. Very kind of you to say. I do love these gardens and helping my students grow. Huh. Literally. Lovely speaking with you. Have a wonderful day. Oh, and remember, be kind to your Wigan trees. Well, I've definitely learned that from this conversation. Thank you. Um, can we talk to you about anything else? No. Okay. Avelio. Where do you keep the mandrakes? Aha! Greenhouse tree. Situated at the center of Hogwarts, a greenhouse... Uh, sorry, situated at the center of a Hogwarts greenhouse, a this giant tree has a system of roots in deep reaching and convoluted as the school's dungeon. All right, let's go in here. Thank you again for delivering those potions to Madame Lawing. That's all right. Save me a lot of time and trouble. Um, potions recipe. We don't have enough money for this. What I need is a mandrake. Okay, so I think for the first time we're going to be heading to Dogweed and Devcap. Um, these are all shops we actually have not been to yet. Rebellion. So these all have locks on them. I can't wait to learn a little more. It's so hard to like run past all these places. Oh. Nice. Um, cool, let's run up here. And see if we can buy a mandrake seed Doesn't here. Get any more cozy than Hogs Revelia. Sorry, didn't mean to shut you up, but I did. All right, let's go in here. Come on, Hello. Oh, watch yourself, though. Let's have you leave here alive. Oh, I want this. What a cute painting. Okay. You're a force to be reckoned with, aren't you? Scaring all the goblins away. I know. What can I say? Um, also, I just wanna see if we can help this little butterfly. Lumos. Oh, that's right. 
That, I swear that is right out here. Right? Or is that over there? I'll be on here. Oh, there's a chest up there. Wait, oh my gosh, there's so much to do around here. Okay, come with me, little butterfly. Little sheep. <laughs> the sheep add a very British or English touch because I feel like it's so typical oh, for... Inside. Oh, um, watch yourself, though. For England. Let's have you leave here alive. Nice. Let's get the field page. Being a thrashing to a troll. Oh, I can't believe you it. You love to chat, Beatrice. Hello. Oh, hello. Hello. <laughs> oh, sorry, I'm in a bit of a tizzy. I was just scolding some of the plants for spitting and nipping. I suppose it's my own fault for putting more than four to a tray. By the way. Beatrice Green is the name, but you may address me as Madam Green. That's Welcome right. to Dogweed and Death Cap. Oh, uh, mind you, don't knock the mandrakes. Oh, if there wasn't the constant demand for antidotes, I wouldn't need to stalk so many of the little dears. Except, of course, for curses. And well, if you've been petrified, then obviously you've come to the right place. <laughs> Mind you don't knock the mandrakes. Oh, if there's an uprooting, you'll be the next one to drop dead and I'm in no mood for a clear up. Um, actually, are you saying someone died here? Someone <laughs> died here? Aye. Fortunate, really, that it was just the one. Now then, how may I help you today? I think I'll just have a look around for now. Very well. Let me know if you see anything you like. Uh, may I see your wares, What do you please? have for sale? Well, what say we show you some of what's available? Um, I'll take a mandrake seed, please. You're a force to I be reckoned with. I kind of grow it them. myself. Sk oh, I'm always thrilled when a young one makes a wise purchase. I can tell you'll go far. Thank you. I think we need anything else. We also don't have the money for open. anything else. You be sure to stop by soon. See ya. Um, Lumos. Also, oh, not Lumos. What I need to do... Oh, oh, no, 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 no. And then um, do this. And let's open this guy. Nice. And that's everything in here. So thank you very much, Beatrice, and see you soon. I'm just gonna get this chest up here. Hogsmeade, here I come. I want to do an episode where I'm just kind of exploring the world and flying around on my broom and checking out random places. If you guys would be up for that, let me know. Looks like there's more balloons over there. Um, cool. I think that's everything. Also, I think that's everything to be honest. Okay, so let's go plant our mandrake. Um, actually, let me see if we need anything else for the quest for Pro Professor Sharp. So we need an invisibility potion and a thunder brew potion. I believe you are ready to learn Arresto Momentum, the slowing charm. It allows you to freeze objects or people in midair. Simply complete Ooh. a few tasks and then come and see me. That sounds great. Thank you very much. I feel like, oh god, I'm getting a bit overwhelmed with the amount of schoolwork that we have to do. Thank it is a busy for year for us. To That's Save all right. Save me a lot of time and trouble. Um, can I buy this potion of you? Oh, I can. I'm gonna buy this. Oh, Don't have money to decision. buy the potion now. Thank you. So for the Thunderbird potion, we need Shrivel Fig Fruit and Stench of the Dead. Stench of the Dead and Shrivel Fig Root. Maybe we have enough money to buy some of that? I, I doubt do for it. You today? Stint of the dead. A wise decision. Let's go grow our mandrake in the room of requirement. Okay, let's see. Can we grow... Um, so we need to make an invisibility... We need troll bogies. Wonderful. 
Okay, and now let's see if we can grow our mandrake. Mandrake. Okay, I know I know this is a bit all over the place, but desperate times call for desperate measures, okay? So I need to grow this. Purchase from Magic Neep. Damn. Okay, we need more money first. Maybe in the meantime, we should grow some more mandrakes. We'll empty the pot later. Okay, let's do that. Let's do the main quest first. So we get more money. And then we go and buy ingredients. Or seeds for the ingredients. We have to go to the magic neep. And we have to go back to uh, the potions. Pippin's potions. To buy ingredients. Okay. It's gonna be fine. It's gonna be fine. What is this place? There's um, a lot of enemies around here. Off on another Saint Backer's adventure, Tower. Are we? What does this say? That way. This is weird. What is this place? This world is just endless, I swear. Oh my god, cent are those centaurs? No, those are just guys. Why are they just randomly walking around here? This seems like a dangerous place to go for a stroll. Over here. Hi, Professor Fig. We're not alone. We are not. Ranrock's loyalists. Around a dozen, I can see, but could be more. Can't we operate past them into the tower? We could, but we've no idea what's in the tower. More importantly, however, I'd like to know why they're here. They've set up camp just ahead. I suggest we investigate a little before doing anything else. Let's go. Okay. I'm just gonna um, change my spells. I'm just gonna add this one. And then I think we'll be good. Well, this isn't ideal. No, it isn't. This way. And I'd suggest we use the disillusionment charm here. No sense in announcing our arrival. I'm ready. Quickly You're the now. one who's visible. Reaching an enemy undetected allows you to cast Petrificus Totalis. This will permanently incapacitate a weaker enemy and sig or significantly damage a stronger one. Avelia. Stay hidden and cast Petrificus Totalis. I'm trying. Petrificus Totalis. Well done. Where are we going next? Sir? Uh, there must be something here. Ramrock said so. Okay. I like stealth. Feel much better doing stealth. What about there must be something here. Ramrock said so. Uh oh. Cool. We're almost done. Avelia. I don't know. Do we listen to them first? What was that? Let's see. There's a letter here. Orders directly from Ranrock. Search These the tower. orders indicate that they're after something to do with names. What names? And why here? Search the tower and the surrounding area. Look for anything to do with the names. What you find here can be the key to Goblin Kind finally taking its rightful place in the world. Ranrock. Scared me, dude. I will draw blood. Okay. Good for you. Do you think this is funny? Much too slow. Oh, that's as bad as they get me. 
Many goblins have always been antagonistic towards wizard Cavellio. But this is different somehow. I'm just gonna loot everything first before we do anything. Because I also came here for the dollar. It's more than mere coincidence that we encountered Ranrock's loyalists here. There's something down there. Or is that beneath the ground? Okay, there's loads down there. Can't imagine the goblins know about the trials. They know that something is significant about this place, though. Looks right. like we found the entrance. Let's see. It's locked. Alohomora will do that for you. An wow. unlocking charm. Very handy. No time now, but if you don't learn it soon enough, we can work on it back at the car. Oh, finally! Please! Um, there's chests? There's a book. Someone who's an avid reader. Can't say I'm familiar with many of these titles. Well, they haven't been here for years, though. It's very dusty. Okay. I guess we'll keep going. Someone here? Interesting design, again. Oh God, I'm so proud of Rebellion. the set designers for this game. It's everything. I imagine these brooms have been enchanted for centuries. Never seen an enchantment last this long. Well, maybe it's either special ancient magic. Welcome to San Bacar's Tower. Ah, hello. Um, right, I can't get in there, so... Hello, Professor. Did you say San Bacar's tower? I did. Professor Bacar is a keeper you have yet to encounter. I'm glad to see that I was correct in presuming that we would meet again soon after our last encounter. Though I surmise, based on the commotion I heard, that you did not have an easy time getting to me. We did not, Professor. We encountered goblins outside it was okay. the tower. That goblins were aware of my vault is disquieting enough. But if they have also made a connection to this tower, then the threat may be greater than I thought. All the more reason for us to move forward. Downstairs, near the entry, a reservoir of ancient magic, like those you've seen before, has been unlocked. Command it to access a doorway. I'm afraid I cannot say more. As Professor Fig cannot join you, he and I will, in time, see you back at the map chamber. Remember Stay what you with see. Me. I always feel safer when there's like We're a companion with me. We're going to need to understand me. how Ranrock's loyalists knew about a tower that once belonged to a keeper. For the moment, however, you've more important things to set your mind to. A reservoir of ancient magic, I believe? Yes, sir. Then I shall leave matters in your increasingly capable hands. That said, be careful. I will, sir. Okay. I'll see you back in the map chamber. Can you teach me a little more first? Because I can't get through this door. The Reservoir of Ancient Magic. Downstairs, near the entry. <gasps> oh! No! Oh. That was an accident. I wanted to check out these papers first. Not me being clumsy and falling down a cliff. Oh my goodness. Oh. Always drink a cup of tea. There's always time for a tea break. Oh. This is slightly concerning. Since there's some um, enemies. Maybe? Lumos. 
Oh, is there our enemies? Oh, we're in like the dream state. Just in case. Going left. Oh, they're behind this door. Oh, damn. Alright, here we go. First trial, I'm gonna save my game. <laughs> here we go. Oh. Okay. I've seen this before in Gringotts and the restricted section. Wow. If this game doesn't win best art direction, I don't know what will, to be honest. This is insane. Rebellion. Look at this. Just like the details and everything, like these and these. Oh. Okay, first trial coming up. Oh my goodness, it's so beautiful. <laughs> my heart is singing, you guys. No. A lie? We have to complete the trial. We can go down the stairs. Guess we're going down the stairs. Guess we're doing it. Impressive. That must have done something. Best have a look around. Wigan well potion. Oh god. What are we gonna be fighting? I am worried. It's like we're underwater. Are these gonna give us more wigan well potions? Ooh, an overcoat. Oh, fancy schmancy. I don't know if we can leave the trial now that we're here. Okay. Oh, lordy lord. They are the bunch we're gonna fight. Can't go back now. Is of ancient magic. Something must be different. The fact that we're gonna fight these is different. Rebellion. It's giving us a lot of gear. Ah, this beige scarf will keep me safe. <laughs> okay, well, I guess we're. Are we stepping through this portal? Okay, we're somewhere else now. Give me potions. We're gonna be fighting some. Rebellion. Oh God, there's so many. Oh God. These are never a welcome sight. At least I know what to expect this time. Is it all of them? Can bring them. Okay, 
At least that's some of them. I'm just gonna wait until we heal up. Rebellion. Anything else around here? No, the door did just open. So we can either go ahead or go for this door. I'm gonna say go for this door. What have the keepers planned for me? Is there is something weird about this? Oh. Okay, run. Run! I'm worried we're never gonna make it. Okay, we're good. <laughs> Nice. I'm gonna try and do this without using too many potions. Oh, goodness, look at this game! These look familiar. Yeah, we have to move them around to get to chests. There, I haven't gotten that chest yet. Oh my god, there's like a massive dude there. <gasps> Yikes. See, and then if we if we get this and like run this way. Yes. And now we jump across this. Get this first. Jump back. And then do this. And do this. There we go. Easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. I find it so funny when people complain that I um, swear too much in my videos. What did that burst of magic do? Perhaps I should examine things from both sides of the archway. Revelia. Okay. Oh! Wait, so what happens when you... Gave me something. See? Okay, let's quickly change our wardrobe. Quick outfit change. Oh, this looks quite cute. I like this outfit. Okay. I guess we're gonna keep going. So powerful. Is that all of them? That is all of them. Rebellion. Okay. Let me just look around first. I like looting, madam. Something must be different. Seems I ought to explore this archway from both sides. Ah, there we go. Akio. Let's go! Potato! Oh, God damn it! Okay, let's try this again. 
Some gloves. Revelio. No. Okay. Um. Now. Let's go back through. So that's it. I need to use both sides of the archway to get the platform to the other side of the bridge. And now we move this over here. And then it is. And there we go. I'll never get used to these floors. No, they're really trippy. Alright, we're gonna be fighting some more, guys. Are you ready? Magic. Um, and we did quite well. I don't think we used our Wigamel potion, so proud of me. A little tap on the head, shoulder, that area. Okay, there's another portal. Probably gonna have to do the same again where we. Oof, close. Um, we can go that way. Or we can go that way. Barfi also wants to check this out. Um, so. Oh, well, we did. Magical glow above it. Can I like climb this? Oh. Okay. And then can we fly through this maybe? What if we 
we do this? We take our platform through this. Can we do that? Oh god. Uh. Okay, make this jump. <laughs> I feel like I'm really doing a weird job with this. Yeah. I think that's it, right? We kind of did it our own way, I think. Like, this works. Okay. We're back here. So does that mean we've completed the trial? God, this girl must be so lost. <laughs> Have we been here before? I don't remember. Oh god, why is there stuff happening? We were oh god, we just got five potions. What are we gonna fight in here? Uh-oh. Just turned Australian. I'm a nerd. Emma, the condensation. Oh, these stairs freak me out. Hello? I have arrived. Don't like the look of this. We're fine, we're fine, we're fine. Oh god. Okay. Get him. Bam. Okay, we're gonna do okay. We're gonna do okay. God damn, made me waste my confringo, bro. We just missed that. Pew pew pew! Oh, we did it. Oh. Okay. That's fine. Oh. Okay. We're fine. Sir, do you mind if I, like, change one of my spells? What is this? Okay. Okay, one second. I need to change some spells. Destroy this as it's charging up. Interesting. Okay, now we need to destroy that orb. How do we destroy it? I don't understand. I don't understand. I don't under I don't get it. Okay, wait. Um Fuck, I don't think Expelliarmus is gonna do anything though. Okay, so I think we need to I think we need to match the color of the orb. Ow. Okay, yes, that's it. Ancient magic, nice, nice, nice. We're gonna get there. Just 
to all possible spells at him, guys. Oh god, oh god, oh god. He pulled out. We're almost there. Nice. Oh my god, I think we did it. <gasps> Sweating. It's fine. Ooh. Learn the trial's secret. Okay, what I feel I like we did quite well on that trial. Also, I'm angry. It didn't let me it didn't give me time to collect these things. Okay, let's go learn the secret. Oh. Whoa, is this Percival? Revenia. Percival, this is another pensive. Very interesting design. Beautiful. Once again. Let's view his memories. Oh, it looks like he's crying. Figure the world around you is remarkable. What is it? My father isn't getting better. I don't think he'll ever recover from the death of my brother. It is agonizing to see those we love suffer. Very true. The trout was years ago. But the pain of losing him is as deep for him now as if it had happened only yesterday. He doesn't need pretty pillars, he needs peace. What if I could help him, Professor? You do so With much your for your father magic? already. It's not enough. I want to take away his pain. It is tempting, I know. To use this magic that you're mastering to transfigure more than the physical world. But human emotion is a potent force unto itself. She trying to talk Even about the most well meaning and competent witch cannot possibly know the consequences of irrevocably manipulating it. So I'm to watch as my father's pain destroys him. It is not your pain to take. Oh, side eye. She's gonna learn the forbidden curse. Is she gonna avada kedavra him? Every year, a student sees something sillier than I could ever imagine in their tea leaves. Oh, Miss Morganach, welcome back to Hogwarts, Professor. That's going to take some getting used to, mm. Professor Rickwood. I was so pleased to hear that you'd accepted the position of defense against the dark arts, Professor. Sit, sit, Isadora. Tell us about your travels. I was actually hoping that you and the others might join me at my home this evening. There's much I'd like to share with you. That would be delightful. We shall let the others know. Very well. I shall see you then. Another memory. Now to find a way out of here. Right, let's do this. More crystallized stone. That must be the way back to the map chamber. We can't go in there. All right, let's go in here. Let's do this. God, you guys, this game. Genuinely, I don't think I've felt about a game like this since Ghost of Tsushima. Obviously, Harry Potter has a close place to my heart, so... We knew this was gonna happen. <laughs> what have we here? I'm a student at Hogwarts, sir, and this is Professor Fig. Professor Charles Rookwood at your service. Has someone completed the first trial? I, I have, have, Professor Rookwood. 
Have I seen you before? You look familiar, sir. I imagine you saw me in the first pensive you accessed, in Gringotts. So, you found the port key to access Professor Rackham's vault, and you deciphered the map within the locket you found floating above that pensive. I did. I found something that I can't identify floating above the last pensive. Ah, yes. You will find a similar artifact in each trial. You must take care to keep them safe. You will need them to complete the journey we have set forth for you. Once you have them all, we will tell you what to do with them. Very well. Are you able to tell me anything about the next trial? Before you proceed, I would like to speak with Charles regarding the urgent situation involving the goblins. The goblins? The student has seen traces of a powerful dark magic being wielded by goblin kind. They and their mentor, Professor Fig, not only encountered goblins lurking outside of San Bacar's tower, they also encountered a powerful goblin in my vault at Gringotts. Hmm. I'm afraid it would be wise to halt the trials until we know more. We shall defer to you in this matter, of course. Yeah, of course. Now then... Wait, Professor. The name Rookwood, do you think... That there's a connection to Victor? Perhaps, but we can't be sure of its significance, if any. For now... Tell me what you saw in the pensive. Before the witch from the last pensive, Isadora, became a Hogwarts professor, she argued with Professor Rackham about using magic to remove pain. Hmm. Hopefully the next pensive provides more I think you'll be forbidden curses. For now, we should learn what Ramrock knows. I will be honest. I've no idea where to start. Actually, I might know of someone. I saw Serona at the Three Broomsticks speaking to a goblin once. They seemed friendly. Well, it's worth a try. See what you can find out. Of course, don't forget... My studies. Yes, sir. Uh, before you go... Uh, uh, yes? Professor? Have you encountered swirling traces of magic in the world? Uh, aside from those along our path? Not that I recall. What are they? Evidence of the Keeper's efforts to manipulate the power of ancient magic during our time. If I am correct, and I usually am, you should be able to use them to inform and enhance your own magic. Thank you, sir. Interesting. I will look out for them. Thank you very much. That's a Keeper. <laughs> wow, that pundle. <gasps> Is it autumn time? We're in autumn! Ah! Oh. oh, we haven't been here in ages. Oh, I'm about to cry again. Ooh, read mail. We complete another quest. Let's do that first. Leveled up again. Or almost. Very, very close. Let's read our mail. Um, we've got another one from Professor Fig. Um, let's see. Come and see me as soon as you can. I've returned from a rather unproductive trip from to the ministry. I hope your time has been more fruitful than mine. Okay. Um, we should probably use our talent points because we've got two now. Um, so we can't do. Oh, we can do some spell ones now. Um, glacius would be good. Confringo would be very good because I've been using that a lot. I think glacius will be a good one too. That's all of our points used up. Um, let's check out what other quests we have because there is so much we have to do. Um, there's all these freaking assignments that we have to do for homework. Um, you can already see that I'm falling behind on my schoolwork. I'm going to start with this one because I feel like Kogawa's um, assignments are a bit easier to do than Professor Garlic's. <gasps> Actually, we should check up on our... Um, mandrakes. They must have grown by now. The broom upgrade's ready. Ha! Stop by the shop nice. when you can. Thank you. Mandrake. Mandrake, I'm glad they don't scream. I hope you will come and see me about a pressing and highly confidential matter at your earliest convenience. Okay. I believe that we may be able to help each other. 
Wow, what a voice. We are going to help Please each other. Class My god, I'm being spammed. Tasks I've set for you. I would like to teach you Descendo. Useful for pulling objects to the <gasps> So ground. much homework. I wonder if I need to move my camera to the other side because you can't ever see the envelopes. God, look at all these assignments and all these quests. <laughs> There's so much. There's so much we have to do. I can't keep up. I'm gonna. Okay, I am overwhelmed. I actually also quickly want to go to Hogsmeade and see if we can buy um buy some ingredients. So we had to go to what was it called? Was it this one? Magic Neep. That's where we have to go for one of these. And then afterwards, um, we have to go back to Pippin's potions and get another, another ingredient so we can brew those potions. We can do three assignments. Sometimes it seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. Oh, yes, and Butterbeer. Hello. Greetings. Hi. Please take your time looking about. Um, I'm just looking for some seed flux weed, not grass, shriveling frig. No! I need more money! I need 40 more gold? There no must be something around here. We can get this. Oh, and that's 500. See? We're fine. Let me just use my charm. Um, actually, no, let me do this. Because I quite like this. Okay, there we go. Let's get this chest. We have to go from the other side. <laughs> Give me the money. Oh, thank God. Revelia. Anything else down there? There's more down here. Oh my God, please. Give me all the loot. Your girl needs it. Your slots are full. Oh, there's something here. Hogshead dogs. These dogs outside the Hogshead Inn offer a pleasant place to sit and relax if one can do so whilst only a stone's throw away from what whatever nefarious goings on maybe goings on may be occurring in a notoriously shady inn. Rebellion. That's quite dark. Love that. I'm back. Hello. Be with you in a bit. Give it to me. Now, you let me know if there's anything else I can help you with. That's all right. Thank you. No one can Bye. say I don't keep a stack shelf. Then we need the uh, um, bogies. Troll bogies. A wise decision. Uh, I can't remember how many Thank we you. need. Okay, so we have everything for the invisib invisibility potion. Okay, um, I'm sorry. I'm just quickly gonna empty this pot and I'm gonna plant. Um, incorrect pot size. Oh, finally. Oh! Very happy about this. All right, let's quickly plant the shrivel fig. Oh my God, finally. We have a bunch of mandrakes as well, which means we can already use those on enemies. So that's something. Um, I'm pretty sure we have something we can identify. This will be no. more useful when I have something to identify. Okay. Um, oh, we can actually make one of the potions before I forget. Um, we can make the um, invisibility one. <gasps> Lovely. Um, and then I think that's it. Now we just need to wait for the 15 minutes for the shrivel fig plants to be done. <gasps> okay, pardon me. Kind of. I kind of. I kind of just want to do the beast class just so I have another class to go to. Um, and then after that, I'll focus on the assignments. I promise. I promise, I promise, I promise, I promise. Peace class. I can't wait, I can't wait, I can't wait. Please let me leave me Hippogriff or Sniffler. Is this my table? Where am I? Oh, begin. 
Oops. <laughs> Welcome, everyone. I see you've already met some of the many beasts we study in this class. Though be advised, none of these creatures should be taken lightly. They are all in their own way dangerous, especially if one does not know how to handle them properly. Now, it seems many of you are out of practice. Let's take some time to review the basics of how to care for a beast, shall we? Miss Sweeting, would you please assist our new student with the lesson today? Yes, Professor Howen. Hello, I'm Poppy. Poppy Sweeting. Nice to meet you. Don't worry about Professor Howen's speech. She over-exaggerates sometimes. <laughs> All the beasts in class are perfectly safe. Oh! Miss Sweeting, so pay attention, please. The tongue of a puff skin can be a slippery devil. Uh, yes, Professor. Wasn't there a guy who hey, was afraid of puff skin? You can practice on Gerald. Just keep Gerald. an eye his tongue. <laughs> oh my god, Gerald, you're so cute. You can use my brush. Just be gentle. Oh, and think pleasant thoughts. I, can I like to think him. it enriches his experience. Oh my god. He? Oh. That's lovely. <laughs> I'm sure he feels much better. That I think is he so might be cute. Hungry. Would you mind giving him some beast feed? Of course. I'm gonna put the food in this one. And then have some snacks. What do you suppose the pellets taste like to <laughs> Gerald? <laughs> Pudding, I like to think. That is I so I think we can cute. safely say that Gerald likes you. That's good news. I like Gerald. He seems very nice. I want one. He is. Kindness is one of his best qualities. Right after ambition. And cleanliness. Ambition? Good work, everyone. Now... Let's make our way to the pens and select another beast. And please, do be careful as you feed and groom them. Miss Sweeting, why don't you show our new student to the measles in the farthest pen? I'm so excited! This way, okay, the measles are over here. Wow, what are those? They look like cats? But they're not. Oh. Couple of these or whiskers ought to get me a few canuts at least. Enough to buy something from Honey Jukes. <laughs> don't you dare. Dude, don't be Stupid mean. Thing. Dude, what the hell? What in Merlin's name are you doing? Ugh, tuss, tuss, peculiar poppy. Worried about a worthless little rodent? Her name is Persephone. <laughs> Her name is Persephone. <laughs> um, can the really Ravenclaw in the background shut the hell up and stop acting stupid? <sighs> Let's go. Idiot. I'm sorry that happened to you, baby. Those two don't belong anywhere near this class. Coaches and training. Persephone was on to them instantly. Thank you for your help. Let's carry on. Feed and brush the measles just as you did with Gerald. I will do. I'll feed all of them. Here, have a snack. That'll make you feel better. Okay, you can have a brush. <laughs> the measles really took to you. They know a good egg when they see one, as do I. It appears our time has come to an end. Please close the pens and see yourselves out. Now, where is our new student? Ah, there you are. I would like a moment, please. Okay, I'd love to meet you too. I just want to check these out. Hey, guys. <laughs> I love them. There's a baby one. Hi, nice to meet you. Hello, Professor. You wanted to speak with me? I did. How did you find your first beast Amazing. Lesson? I love that your costume also suits like dragon scales. It was wonderful. I believe I'm really going to enjoy this class. Good. 
You seem to understand that when beasts are properly controlled, they can play a vital role in our lives. Some provide us with magically imbued materials, if cared for correctly, which does not include torturing them for whiskers. Well done, by the way. Probably best to let me handle it next time. Yes, Professor. Yeah, They're I don't know why she didn't even say anything to be honest. In Rookwood's Take points, pack. like... Sadly, we're the ones who suffer. Stumbling over dead beasts? Terrible waste of resources. Surely the poachers can be brought to justice by someone. The Ministry, perhaps. Hmm. I guess that'll An be up to us, eh? idea. Now, why don't we focus on more immediate matters that we can control? Professor Weasley has asked that I prepare some assignments designed to help you catch up to the other fifth years. Be on the lookout for my owl. Meanwhile, I also encourage you to study as many beasts as you can on your own time. Okay. I will do. Thank you very much. Hey, over here. Come on. What can I help with, Poppy? Did you need something, Poppy? Thank you again for saying something to those brutes so that I didn't have to. You were an augury at noon in the desert. I certainly hope that's a good thing. It's something my gran and I say. It means that something or someone is a welcome surprise. Aww. At least Thank that's you. what we decided it meant. I couldn't stand there and watch them harm the poor thing. We're of a similar mind. Actually, in light of that, there's someone I'd like you to meet in the forest. The Forbidden Forest? Sounds intriguing. You've intrigued me. Very well, lead the way. I'd hoped I would. All right, take me there. I wouldn't take just anyone there. In fact, you're the first. Really? Well, thank you, I think. As I said, we think alike. Pleasant surprise. She's flirting with me? <laughs> <sighs> Quite the weather we're having, don't you think? Poppy, where are you taking me? It really is much better if I just show you. Oh, sorry, just take me. Just collecting some moonstone in the Don't meantime. Don't worry, we're nearly there. It's just ahead. Oh, so it's not the Forbidden Forest. Stand back. It's a hippogriff. It's a hippogriff. Magnificent. Go on, introduce yourself to her, but be careful. You must always show hippogriffs the proper courtesy before you approach them. Bow for them. I'm tearing up. There's just all these experiences that I wish I could actually experience. And I feel like this game is probably like the closest to what I can get out of this world. I honestly can't even describe like how much this means to I me. I knew it. I don't think I've ever seen a hippogriff take to someone this quickly. You can feed and brush her if you'd like. Let's start with brushing. I come and check on her every once in a while. Bring her pasties. Tell her what's going on in the castle. You wouldn't know from looking at her, but she's a dreadful busybody. She seems really sweet. Bon appétit. Nice to meet you, Highwing. See ya. Mm. Beautiful. So, what did you think of Highwing? Thank you so much for showing me her. She was brilliant. I thought she was brilliant. Can't believe you introduced me to her. I suspected you two might get along. Are you the reason students have been seeing hippogriffs flying above the Forbidden Forest? Hmm, perhaps. Did you know that once you earn a hippogriff's trust, they'll oh, always be there for you? That's so I've sweet. I've seen it firsthand with her. How exactly did you and Highwing cross paths? It's a longer story. 
But I rescued her from poachers a few years back, got her to safety and, well, she was fine until recently. You may have noticed that poachers are something of a problem yeah, in the area, professor said. so I worry they could get her again, and I might not be there next time. Professor Howen mentioned the poachers as well. She seemed to imply that we couldn't rely on the Ministry to help. We're gonna have to do something about it. I don't often agree with Professor Howen, but on that, I fear she's right. The poachers' influence is growing. I see them every day in the village, lingering, talking to people. They're up to something. I'm just not sure what. Okay. We that does seem strange. Should check Sounds out. Sounds as if they're planning something. Exactly. I don't want any I animals to be harmed. I think I'm going to, to look harmed. into it. Find or out beasts. what's going on. What they're doing. Would be good to investigate. I think that's a fine idea. Information is power. And the more I know, the better I can keep Highwing safe. You seem undeterred. Will you let me know what you find out? Oh, very well. I will. I should be going, but we'll speak again soon, I hope. Yeah, we will. Nice to meet you. We did our first beast class, you guys. Um, on that note, I think our thingies must almost... Oh, we actually we have a talent point. Um, which I think I might see if we can spin it on a core thing. New spell set is added. That sounds good. Um, yes, let's quickly check out the room of requirement. Make sure we have the potion so we can do that first thing next time. Actually, so we can just scratch off some assignments of our list. I think that's what I want to focus on in the next episode. I want to get our schoolwork up to date. Um, yes. Yes. And other potions should be ready now. Um, let's get it. Um, and let's make... Thunderbree potion. Okay, so that means that'll be ready by the time we make the next episode. So in the next episode, let's quickly go through the quest list. In the next episode, um, I want to make sure we do all these assignments. So we're going to do Professor Garlic's one because uh, we have all the ingredients and things for that. Uh, we just need to test out some enemies. And um, then I want to do um, Professor Madame Kogawa's um, assignment with flying around on our broom. Professor Sharp with the potions that we've made today. Um, I want to check out Professor Onai's assignment. Um, oh, the pulsal. Actually, I haven't properly tried the pulsal yet. The Sendo would be a very good spell to learn, to learn how to descend things. Um, and then maybe try these ones, because I'd love to, you know, do some dueling. Purchase another broom. I feel like these are all things we can do in the next episode. And then we can focus on the main assignments. Thank you all so much for watching this episode. Make sure that if you like it, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. If you want to see more, have a lovely day, guys. And see you soon. Bye.